I've had a number of people in comments uh, ask me to do uh, a few recipes that came from the Army when I was in the Army in Korea. Uh, I have them from my childhood and before that and the cowboy recipes and things like that. But I've never done a strictly an Army one before. So I thought I would do a typical uh, military barrack style uh, breakfast. That's that's where they have a mess kitchen for a company size unit of a couple hundred people. And uh, the breakfast this morning is going to be their basic uh, cottage fried potatoes with ham and scrambled eggs. Uh, it sounds simple enough and really it is. You know, it's the bane of every guy coming into the military. They get called up on details. And I hadn't been in the Army three or four days and my name appeared on a detail sheet for KP. And I learned very quickly that KP means keep peeling. They set me down in the floor there with bags of potatoes and a knife. And he told me, he said, start peeling these potatoes. Put the peeled potato in this tub here. Don't waste the potatoes. Put the peels in the garbage can and peel this whole stack here. And it looked like enough potatoes there to feed a, a thousand man army. But at, at any rate, I, it took me a couple hours to get them peeled. I have already peeled my potato this morning and diced it. And I'm going to make uh, hash brown, or not hash brown, but cottage fried potatoes. And you just cut them up in little dice size cubes. And I'm going to use my own mix of herbs that I have here. It's very simple. It's salt, black pepper, uh, cumin, oregano, and a little chili powder. And uh, I'll sprinkle this over these. Now normally to cook these I would get out my old steel skillet Take these round, but since I'm going to be making a video and need to speed things up and get it done, I'm going to use the air fryer that, by the way, one of my subscribers sent to me. And when I got it, I didn't figure they would be using it, but I've used it a while, and now I wouldn't be without it. Uh, got them seasoned and uh, next to go in the air fryer. This is the parchment paper here. It's to keep the small pieces from falling through into the bottom. And I'm going to uh, spray these with a little canola cooking oil to help them brown. And that goes into the air fryer now. Okay, two people, two slices of spam, cut in little cubes. A little turn of olive oil here.
it up in little little cubes. Nothing precise here at all. Just need to break it up to where it can be scattered in with the eggs as they cook. And let that start cooking. didn't get cut up all the way. Let that get happy. And here it is on the table. Typical breakfast. It's uh, scrambled eggs with spam cottage fried potatoes and peaches and another change that was made was uh, that everybody would get a fresh slice of bread no more hard tie and uh, we had a bakery available and they bake bread each night and uh, we had fresh bread with our meals five bite of spam and eggs here Just like I remember it. Try to buy this potato. Oh, by the way, you know some eating with a spoon? <clears throat> Mess kits came with a spoon, a fork, and a knife. And the fork was so near the spoon that it didn't make any difference. And the knife was totally useless. It was too limber and everything. So we just used our pocket knife, threw the fork and knife away, and just used the spoon. And we ate the whole time we were in the Army out of a spoon. And it, it just became second nature with me. I still do occasionally. That, that is good scrambled eggs and, and spam. So, God bless Texas, God bless USA, and please keep us safe here and try to save our nation for us. I realize we have to do our part by voting Republican and getting rid of these crazy Democrats and socialists and progressives and idiots that have been elected to run our country. Bye.